Alright fellas, welcome back, and I am back with a Halo 5 gameplay and discussion. But first of all guys, check out this new assassinations here, check this out. Oh, yeah, look at that, oh my goodness, that is beautiful. Okay fellas, so that was just, I think that's the coolest assassination I've got in Halo 5 so far. But anyway fellas, welcome back, and I'm back with, as I mentioned before, a Halo 5 gameplay and discussion. And what I want to talk to you guys about in this video is that I am still seeing people hating on Halo 5. Now I know I've gone over this before, but I honestly do not see why people keep complaining about this game. Like, what is it that people keep keep on moaning about? And I, I suppose you could call me a bit of a moaner for keep on for I keep on making these videos. But I'm almost at the point where I'm about to call out some of these channels because all I see is. Ah, uh, like, after the Hammerstorm DLC came out, right, I was expecting Halo channels, and it's not all the Halo channels that do this, but I was expecting, like, guides, discussions, gameplays, kind of like what I do, right? But instead I see top, top six things Halo 6 needs. Are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? As soon as an amazing DLC comes out with all sorts of interesting content that you should be covering, all I see is hate. Are you flipping kidding me? All I see is hate. On these crybaby kids who don't know anything about video games who aren't even proper Halo fans because if you are a Halo fan then you should obviously have questions and discussions and obviously be able to question 343 and Microsoft but you shouldn't be hating on this company and these developers these developers know what they're doing Halo 5 is a great game it has great content it's going to continue to have great content and I keep seeing these channels hating and people are still going on about the no split screen shit are you kidding me? Who these days comes from com comes home from a hard day of work and goes, I know what, I'm gonna sit down and split screen. No one does that. You sit down, you stick your Turtle Beach headsets on, and you game. By yourself in a party chat over Xbox Live with friends, or obviously PC and if you're playing on PlayStation. But this is mainly like a Halo discussion. Oh get the double kill. And this is a wee bit of a rant, and I don't want to sound like I'm being an idiot or a crybaby either, but I am just pretty sick of these, not all Halo channels out there, because there are some really good ones, like a big shout out to Ready Up Live, that channel is awesome, be sure to go check it out if you guys haven't checked it out, but of course you guys have it, it's probably one of the biggest Halo channels out there, but there are some others out there, and I, will, I won't name the channels I'm talking about, but just channels that keep doing hate, and aren't covering Halo 5 how they should, and these channels I'm talking about, or the main channel I'm talking about, has about, probably almost 400,000 subscribers, and they aren't even covering or well, they've barely covered, they've barely scratched the surface of covering this new Hammerstorm DLC and even previous DLCs. They do nothing but post up hate videos and I suppose you could just call it opinion videos but but when it's all the time and pretty much almost every day there's got to be an agenda behind it and I don't know what possibly happened but there's got to be some reason why these people are always kind of hating on Thief or 3. And being a fan of something, fellas, you have to be able to question it, right? As I mentioned before, you have to be able to question and obviously expect answers from 343 and Microsoft about certain things, right? But you can't be getting all aggressive and hating. Like, the fact that people are still going on about this no split screen in Halo 5 and saying Halo 6 needs it, honestly, fellas, get over it. And I'm, I'm not talking to my subscribers, I'm, I'm meaning fellas about the people I'm talking about. Get the hell over it. There's no split screen Halo 5. So what? Does that take away from how fun the game is? From how it's getting free content every month? We just got freaking Gripple for God's sake. That's a game mode that fans wanted. So they gave it to us. We get free wrecks, free con content every month as I mentioned before. And something that people don't seem to talk about is Halo 5 has dedicated servers. I've barely had any lag in Halo 5. And the times that I have had lag... It's been Xbox Live issues, not 343 server issues. Okay, Halo 5 is a great freaking game and possibly fails. Halo 6 could possibly have split screen being brought back. Because if you guys don't know, the reason why there is no split screen in Halo 5 is because they wanted to maintain a perfect 60 frames per second to, be, to pretty much show off the game as best they possibly could. And now they're obviously... Obviously, we're getting more into the future, and probably developers are going to be using DirectX 12 and all this sort of cool software, and obviously all the stuff that they can use to help their games out. This is this is probably going to help that, and I can possibly see split screen maybe returning in Halo 6. But if it doesn't, fellas, stop moaning, stop whinging. No one split screens these days, and if you do split screen, trust me, fellas, people aren't split screening Halo 5 multiplayer. Trust me, you need the whole screen for that shit. You need to be able to see where enemies are coming from, not 
and obviously if I was if there was split screen in Halo 5 it would be cut down to 30 frames per second obviously because it's split screen so also bear that in mind fellas but guys this is just a wee bit of a rant and I, I don't want to sound like I'm complaining or anything like that but I'm so sick of this bullshit that I'm seeing New but fellas as I mentioned before I, d I don't want to sound like I'm crying or complaining but I'm getting really sick of people hating on Halo and that's pretty much why I thought I may as well do a video about this. And now I'm a very, very small voice in this big kind of, I suppose you'd call it like a YouTube world. Because I'm a very, very small voice, fellas. But I think that I should get my opinion out there and hopefully more people do it as well to kind of stand up to this bullshit that we've seen. Because Halo 5 is a great game. I mean, just look at it, fellas. This game is simply amazing. All oh, pull off the headshot as we progress into the second gameplay in this video. <laughs> that's how long this rant's going on for. We just have to progress into a second gameplay. But fellas, I will wrap this video up. And as always, thanks for watching. I will leave a link down below to my previous Halo 5 video. That is a talk. Kind of like a breakdown and a wee bit of discussion about that map. That's recently added in the Hammerstorm DLC. I also leave a link down below to my Facebook and my Twitter, be sure to go check me out there, it will be greatly appreciated, and as always, stay safe, stay tuned, have a great day, have a great week, and I will see you fellas on Halo 5, be sure to add me on Xbox Live, Zombie Bang 666, jam out this great game, and I will see you on the next one, yeah!